improper watering contributes to pest and disease problems in your yard? Well, today I'm joined by Richard Duran from ISU. So, Richard, what do we need to know to water our yard? I guess the first thing would be the fact that most surf grasses need about an inch to an inch and a half of water per week. So if you do decide to water, apply that in a single application or maybe two applications three to four days apart. Uh, avoid the frequent light applications of water because that tends to produce a very shallow rooted plant and also may increase disease problems. Hmm. Now when is the best time to water? Uh, early morning is the best time to water, typically sometime between 5 and 10 a.m. If you water in the morning, it soaks in very quickly. You have very little water loss or evaporation. If you water at midday, that can be wasteful. It may carry the water onto streets and, and sidewalks. Uh, as far as watering in the evening, uh, that uh, may increase disease problems because the foliage will stay wet all night long. Okay, now what are some signs to look for to know that it's time to water? There are a couple of good signs as far as to, to uh, put the water on, and that would be the first one would be the color of the turf grass. Uh, typically, well watered turf grass is a, a dark green. When it's under water stress, it's more of a blue green or gray green. Uh, another sign would be the resiliency of the turf. When you have a well watered yard, if you walk across it, it springs right back up. If it's water stressed, you can actually see the footprints after walking across it. Okay, now what if you decide not to water whatsoever? And that's a viable option too. Uh, dormancy is a natural defense mechanism for turf grass. If it's hot and dry, it simply turns brown, it goes dormant. But it can stay in that dormant state for four to six weeks and not suffer any significant damage. All right, good to know. And if you would like more information on watering your yard, be sure to log on to our website. For Gardening in the Zone, I'm Liz Gilman.